So I have uh, been involved with Staff Soldiers for three years. I've been the ambassador for three years. Um, people often ask me why I've chosen this charity and on many others to, uh, to be part of. Um, it's, a, it's an interesting question. Um, for me, it's what the good side of fashion can do. Um, lots of people see the, uh, the glamour of fashion, the fashion shows, the Instagrams, the selfies. Um, I think it can be a little bit of a, a self-centered industry. Um, and, and here we are, and Emma gave me this, uh, when I first met Emma, she gave me this idea of um, the help that fashion can produce very, very quickly. Um, just by making shirts, just by making uh, walking sticks. Um, obviously we've expanded that now, but just those simple things um, to give guys a confidence, to, to give the ex-servicemen and, and ex-service women um, the, the confidence the, the, to walk into a room knowing that they are well dressed and I don't think, I think a lot of people underestimate the power of being uh, well dressed and having that confidence and the, and the confidence it empowers people uh, to be able to uh, move forward in life and that's, uh, their, their quotes really much I've, what I've heard from soldiers and from their families um, and I wanted to be part of that and um, that's why I've become ambassador and uh, that's why I've helped try to bring on uh, M&S and uh, Berlin and Russell and Bromley and a number of brands and uh, as well as other brands on on Savile Row so not just uh, to Emma to be involved but uh, a whole wide range of, of the fashion industry.